K-Gun 9 Sports is sponsored by Casino Del Sol. And now, K-Gun 9 Sports. I'm Jason Barr. It's a football Friday night. We've covered every Buena game this season. We are taking it a step further tonight by going live. Kega 9's Alexis Ramanjulu was recently named one of Cochise County's most influential people. She is at Loveless Field as Buena gets set to host Pueblo. The Colts trying to stay unbeaten. Good evening, Alexis. They Thanks, Jason. Uh, Buena football's 4-0 record is the best start for the school since 1995, and head coach Joe Thomas told me earlier this week that they are playing with a chip on their shoulder, which is making this team stand out from previous years because they missed the playoffs last year despite having a 7-3 record. We're still hungry. Winning is the only option for the Buena Colts, and so far they've done just that. It means that we, you know, we come in, we put the work in, and we're, we're committed, we're focused. The Colts haven't always had success. Thomas's coaching stint started with two winless seasons. The difference, this team and their mentality. Different type of kids. You know, you try to get to all of them, you can't. Um, I think that we, we do have a lot of talent, especially with our junior group. Being able to be 4-0 and perfect thus far. Uh, is is our goal. You know, we've been focusing more on being 1-0 every week. Their next challenge, Pueblo. And if there's another game, Wayne is ready to run. The games before tomorrow don't mean nothing if we don't handle business tomorrow. As soon as you feel like you're satisfied, then you, you start trying to perform and you don't do what it took to get you there in the first place. If the Colts win tonight, they'll be 5-0 for the first time since the 1970s. And the team knows the impact winning has on the community. Small town football is it's great. The environment's great. We pack the stands. As long as we keep winning, I think I think that we, you know, we bring communities together. Jason, like you said earlier, we've been at every Buena home game, and Nash is absolutely right. The fans have packed the stadium. We've been here about an hour before kickoff, and people are trickling in, claiming their spots, and not to mention it's homecoming game today, so we expect another packed st uh, stadium for the game tonight at Loveless Field in Sierra Vista. Alexis Ramanjulu, Kega 9. All right, thank you, Alexis. Arizona football opens up Pac-12 play at Stanford tomorrow night. Now, a couple years ago, Jedfish trademarked Make It Personal. That's because It's Personal wasn't available. But right now, Coach Prime, a.k.a. Deion Sanders, is reportedly trying to trademark It's Personal. I love Coach Prime. You guys know that. We were together in Baltimore. I think he's great. I think he's great for the game. I think he's a fantastic coach. If he wants to say it's personal in Boulder and we want to say it's personal in Tucson, that's just fine. All right, I'll make it personal tonight when I rejoin you at 10 o'clock with all the high school football coverage. Uh, we'll have one more look at weather when we come back after this on KGUN 9 at 6 o'clock.